Okay guys, welcome back to my channel again and today I'm going to be showing you how to update all your Dayton files as, just let me explain, when you get Impart or NCS Expert, um, usually the files will not have been updated, all the Dayton files for the cars and all the ECU prime, the program files for that car and it will struggle to find either your, the correct file for your car and you won't be able to flash it or you, you won't get the latest coding um, updates for it or the latest coding stuff to code your car with so today I'm just going to show you how to update all your datons when you get your SP Dayton files so the first thing you're going to want to open is the BMW coding tool after opening your coding tool you're going to want to go to select SP Dayton then you're going to want to go down to to ship well mine is called Toshiba that's because I've got it all on an external but most people will have it on their local disk ski depending on where you have your Dayton files so then you're going to want to open your data file, so you're going to open your SP source and you're going to want to click what car it is you're using. So for instance, for me, I click E60. Then you're going to click that. Then you're going to go down to here to default folder settings and click NCS Expert. Then you want to go into your local disk C, which it will be on your local disk C and find it and then click on the NCS Expert folder. Then you're going to want to go into Eddie Abbas on the local disk C again, which 100% that will be in there, because it needs to be in there, and click the Eddie Bass folder. Now this is the tricky one, Wing KFP. This folder sits in the EC apps. So to do that, you have to go into local disk C again, and you're gonna wanna go into the EC apps, which is right here, and then you're gonna wanna go down to, and then you wanna click that, NFS and click OK. Now once that's done, I'm just going to show you how it does it. You're just going to click Update SP Dayton. And then it's going to ask you, do you want to back up the existing files? You're going to click No. Now as you can see, it's updating all the files from NCS Expert to WinKFP to the Eddie Bias folder. Now it needs to update them in order to either do an update, to do it, find the latest files for your car. And as you see, the update's been successful to the latest version because when you get NCS Expert, nobody knows what version they're on. So you just have to update them anyway to, before you even attempt to use it. Now, once that's done, you'll go into Start, Computer, your local disk C, and then you'll go down to your EC apps. You can check any of the folders, NFS. Then if you go into your data, you'll find all the latest files there which usually when you get WinKFP or NCS Expert, you won't have these folders, or you will, but you'll be missing the majority of them, and they won't be updated. And if they're not updated, WinKFP will not find any of the modules you put in on your car. And if they don't find them, well then you won't be able to update any of the modules. And the same goes for NCS Expert. If you try and code a module, it will tell you an error, it usually gives you a co error. If it gives you the co error, you won't be able to find on code any of your modules. Now, I'm going to show you how to get into the NCS Expert folder. So you'll go into Computer, Local Disk C, NCS Expert, and then your Datum. And then as you can see, all your files are there. Now, usually when you get that, they'll be empty. There'll be nothing in them. But because I've updated them for that car, especially the E60, as I use that a lot, they're there. But if you was to go into E36, they'll be like that. Or if you went into... These ones, they'll be empty, as you see, because I haven't updated them, and they're usually for E46, but I haven't had updated any E46s. Now, if you get any errors, please just leave a comment in my box below, and I'll be happy to help you with any questions. We have got a few other videos coming up. If you need any help using WinKFP, I've got a video. Please go and look at my other videos, and you'll see how to use WinKFP. Or if you get any errors with NCS Expert, please go and look at my videos, which I show you how to do there and how to use it. And I will be making other videos relating to these programs. If you get any other errors or any kind of comments, any kind of comments or any kind of, you know, questions that you need answering, I'll answer. Or if you get any problems or you're stuck, I'll make a video regarding the problems to help you as much as possible out. Um, we've got another load of videos coming up, which I'm gonna be showing you. As you can see here, we've got the fan belt, the drive belt and the pulley, which I'm gonna be changing on my E60, hopefully sometime this week so we'll be doing another video on how to change all that um i hope you like my channel guys so far thanks for subscribing and bmw dr dean out here i hope you enjoy the channel and thanks for watching goodbye <laughs>